Welcome to my YouTube channel Exploring Academia. The caretaker chief minister, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, Justice, retired, Syed Arshad Hussain Shah, recently announced the upgradation of Khyber Medical College, KMC, Peshawar and Arab Medical College, AMC, Abbottabad, to the status of medical universities. Similarly, the caretaker Prime Minister, Anwar Olha Kakar on recently announced upgradation of KMC and AMC as public sector medical universities. The Prime Minister urged that practical work on upgradation of KMC and AMC as public sector medical universities should be initiated immediately by the respective authorities. This announcement has left the graduates and alumni of KMC jubilant. As their long-standing demand for upgradation of their alma mater to the university level has finally been met. However, the announcement has raised alarm bells in a section of society especially the graduates of KMC. In this video, we briefly discuss the potential benefits and key challenges associated with the proposed scheme. Potential Benefits the upgradation of these medical colleges to a university level can bring about several benefits. Contributing to the overall improvement of medical education and healthcare delivery in the province. Some of the key advantages include Increased capacity and autonomy Upgrading KMC and AMC to universities could expand enrollment capacity, allowing more students to pursue medical careers addressing the shortage of medical and allied health professionals in Pakistan. As a result, the vast academic and research potential of KMC and AMC will optimally be utilized. With the grant of required academic and administrative independence, Improved quality and specialization. These new universities can attract and retain experienced faculty. Invest in advanced research facilities, and offer specialized postgraduate programs. This could elevate the quality of medical education and training. Leading to better healthcare outcomes in the country in the long term. Upgrading to a university status will allow for the expansion and diversification of several academic programs. Economic and Social Benefits These medical universities can attract more research grants and investments. Create new jobs in healthcare and related fields and contribute to the overall economic development of the area. Immediate benefits to the teaching faculty and staff. With upgradation, the teaching faculty of these colleges will be upgraded as per requirements of the Higher Education Commission of Pakistan. Moreover, the administrative staff shall have more opportunities for accelerated promotion. Triggering healthy competition. The upgradation of these institutions to the university level shall foster an environment of healthy competition. And at the end of the day the quality of medical education shall improve. Creating new opportunities for students. Students at these upgraded medical universities may have access to a more diverse range of extracurricular activities. Research opportunities, and Collaborative projects. However, it is critically important to consider potential risks associated with upgrading these medical colleges. With the potential benefits mentioned earlier, these new universities will also face numerous challenges. Financial constraints? Upgrading these prestigious colleges to universities requires significant financial investments for infrastructure development as well as upgradation of research facilities. Ensuring adequate funding for sustained growth and quality education could be challenging as in the case of other upgraded colleges such as Islamia College Peshawar, as well as King Edwards Medical College, Lahore. Faculty Recruitment and Development 
Attracting and retaining qualified faculty members shall be a crucial part for the success of these medical institutions. As it took 15 years for the KMU to hire, develop and retain qualified faculty. Organizational challenges. The transition from colleges to universities might involve administrative restructuring, curriculum adjustments, and changes in faculty positions besides upgradation. Duplication of resources. As there is another public sector medical university namely KMU already exists in the province. Concerns about duplication of resources and competition for limited funding or student enrollment might arise. Even the territorial jurisdiction of KMU shall be split among all the three universities putting in danger the very existence of this fastly growing Kyber Medical University. Quality concerns, accreditation and quality assurance. Achieving and maintaining accreditation standards for a medical university is essential for ensuring the quality of education and research. Navigating the accreditation process and implementing quality assurance measures can be complex. Such a hasty upgradation without proper planning could compromise the quality of medical education in the province. The transition from a medical college to a medical university is a complex process and requires careful planning to ensure a smooth transition without disruption to ongoing educational activities. Mere changing the signboard of a college to a university shall be detrimental and counterproductive. Students' transition. Managing transition for existing students during the upgradation process is a critical consideration as it is the students that are affected adversely all the time. Ensuring that ongoing academic commitments are met and that students receive adequate support during any changes is important for student success. Creating a spiral effect. More medical and dental colleges, both in the public and private sectors in the province will enter the race, demanding autonomy or getting degree awarding status till the time each medical and dental college becomes a university. Stakeholders engagement. Maintaining positive relationships with various stakeholders, including the existing medical university. Healthcare institutions and the community being crucial is virtually overlooked. Building trust through effective communication and collaboration is of utmost importance to navigate challenges and foster support among key stakeholders. Addressing these challenges requires proactive planning, effective communication, collaboration among stakeholders, and a commitment to maintaining high standards of education and research. Additionally, institutions may benefit from seeking guidance from Higher Education Commission of Pakistan. Experienced medical professionals and experts in educational administration and healthcare management during the upgradation process. Overall, the decision may be considered judicious if it is done with careful planning, adequate funding, and a clear vision without harming the interest of an already well-functioning medical university in the province. I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.